Welcome to another episode of Tom and Terry, guys. Today, I'm going to be breaking down how to tie a square lashing. All right, let's dive right into this square lashing. Once you have your horizontal beam laying on top of your vertical beam, you're going to want to start off with the clove hitch. Now, what you want to do is create a little X like I've done here on the base of the vertical post. You're going to pull that through and then put the end of that short loop underneath the X you just made and then pull each side quite taut. In this case, move it a little closer to that horizontal beam because we're gonna be coming through here a few times. Then take the end of your short rope and wrap it around the longer portion of your rope. And now we're gonna take that and on the right, you're gonna go over the horizontal beam, then under the vertical beam on top, and then back over the left side of the horizontal beam. And now you're gonna go under the vertical beam again, right next to that clove hitch you made, then back over the horizontal beam under the vertical. We're gonna do that same process at least three times. I aim for four if you got enough rope for it, just to make sure everything is nice and secure. But you see, we're just gonna repeat this fashion of over on the horizontal, under on the vertical, back over on the left side of the horizontal, and then back under on the vertical. Now I know pulling the rope here can be kind of a bit of a strain sometimes, so take your time with it, but you'll get there. And hey guys, if you're enjoying this video, go ahead and give us a like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. It really helps us out here at Tom and Terry. All right, once you've done that three to four times in that first fashion, we're now gonna go the opposite way. So go over the horizontal beam one more time, just like I did here. And now we're gonna wrap the left to right fashion. As you can see, we're just gonna be going under the horizontal beam this entire time is making sure that initial lashing, those initial over-unders are gonna be extra secure. You're gonna do this a minimum of three times, but four is also acceptable if you have enough rope for it. All right, last but not least, guys, pull everything nice and tight so it's secure, and then you're gonna take the end of your rope underneath the beam one more time and pull it through that little hole you just made, pull it taut, and get your square lashing all set to go. Hey guys, if you enjoyed this video, check us out at Instagram as well, at Commentary. Give us a follow. Stay up to date on our latest and greatest.